What is up, people of YouTube? This is Carter, aka Headshot from Rodan Gaming here, and you've got to be kidding me, I already died like that. Um, anyway, so today I want to talk about a few things. Uh, strictly mostly about uh, E3, Black Ops 3, PS4 kind of stuff. You know, like what the hell is happening? Um, I I'm totally okay with. Yo, did I just overlap UAV? I don't even know. I'm, I'm completely okay with uh, with DLC coming first on on PS4. That's completely cool. That's not even that's not even a big deal. Um, because honestly, like I don't really care about DLC as long as they don't have freaking competitive with DLC maps again. That was that's so stupid. Like, I don't know why, what they were thinking when they decided, well, let's put Drift into the circuit. Um, anyways, so, Black Ops 3, DLC's moving to PS4, that's cool. But I also heard that they're completely switching competitive COD over to the PS4. Like, that's ridiculous. That's a huge change. It's been on Xbox, like, pretty much the entire time, I think, for Black Ops 1... For like a short period of time for like one or two tournaments they were on PS3 you know because they wanted to try it out and everything but now they they built such a, a following on the Xbox and the Xbox one and basically when the Xbox one came out and Advanced Warfare came out for it uh, the Xbox one was basically like the go-to console of you know for up-and-coming pro players um, you know, like, so it seems ridiculous that they're switching over to PS4 because now they're basically giving a huge middle finger to the uh, COD community and basically saying, well, pff, that sucks for you, you gotta pay 500 bucks just for, j just to play, um, you know, competitive COD, to play a 2K or a 5K or whatever, or find a GB easier, uh, or even go pro. And obviously, like, I'm not hating on the PS4 because it is a good console and it's basically the same thing as the X1. Um, the interface is really different, that's basically it, and like a few components on the inside. And some people will, will debate that the PS4 has better graphics than the Xbox One, but that's, I wouldn't say that's true at all, especially because the Xbox One is 4K compatible. And, you know, even people from PlayStation have said, no, we kind of overlooked that in the PS4, which is not really smart, because it's not like it's... A super futuristic thing 4k is happening you know basically now um, we already have 4k TVs we have we have 4k everything basically oh ah, boy struggling on this Wi-Fi connection instead of Ethernet which I'm gonna get in about a week or so anyway so yeah they're, they're basically saying you know buy a PS4 to play some GBs but like I don't want to buy a PS4. Like, I don't, like, okay, cool, my friends are on there, but they don't, you know, they don't play competitive. And, and that's the thing, is like, it's it's less practical too, because there's not as many competitive players on the PS4, and that's because of how big of the following for, for the Xbox uh, and competitive COD has been. Uh, but it's also more practical because, you know, most most players want to play competitive, or people just want to play uh, COD. Uh, so it's cheaper to get an Xbox, so more people like logistically can play it, right? And like it's more affordable to play COD. Um, and if you don't want to buy DLC, that's cool. That's no extra cost because you don't need it. Um, obviously, like, well, I get you don't need to buy the DLC on PS4 either, but it just doesn't make sense to me. Like the DLC, okay, cool, that it makes sense. Again, I'm saying this again because I, like I just can't reiterate it enough. It makes sense for the DLC to come out first on PS4 because in generally there's more casual players on there that will like to buy um, DLC. Not that there isn't a lot on Xbox. I know for a fact that there is. Uh, Xbox players play a lot of DLC. Uh, I know for, like, personally, I, up until Ghosts, I, I, I didn't buy any DLC in Ghosts, but in Black Ops 2, I, I bought DLC, I bought the first DLC, uh, I was thinking of buying the first DLC for Ghosts, but then I was like, mm, no, it's, it's not that, 
it's not that great because they had that like trial period, which is actually really smart. I really hope they bring that back for Black Ops 2. Because that, or Black Ops 3, sorry. That was actually like a, that was pretty fun, you know. They had like a weekend where you could try out the DLC. And that, I like that. that. That was a really good idea. I think, um, you know, it, it's... It's better than, because like, a lot of the times you'll buy a DLC and realize, oh wow, the, everything is bad in here. And, you know, you just don't really enjoy it. And, jeez, like, everybody's coming after me, and only me. But yeah, you realize it sucks, and then you regret paying for it. So if you can at least try it out for a trial for a weekend, then great. You don't have to waste money if you don't like it. But if you do like it, then you can spend money. Um, but Black Ops 3, if you haven't seen it, go check out. Uh, channels that have it uh, and just videos in general because it looks it looks pretty awesome it looks like it's gonna be fun and you know if if it happens that uh, there's no more competitive COD on Xbox well I'll just go pop stomping like crazy I'll make my own camos and shit it'll be awesome I mean it'll, it'll, it'll be horrible and I'll probably still buy a PS4 for that if that happens um, no, I probably won't actually buy a PS4 because I don't have $500 just to draw on an overpriced console. Because, I mean, let's face it, it's a little bit overpriced. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed that, uh, that short video. Tell me in the comments section below, you know, put your grievances there about what, uh, what the hell is going on. Uh, but other than that, like the video, comment, rate, subscribe, like, like always, uh, share the video, get this get this notion out here um i know a lot of people are saying like xbox or riot or whatever and I, c I can understand the frustrations but it's it's whatever it's not a big deal as long as the competitive side stays on xbox one anyways goodbye i hope you guys have a good day and enjoy the, your life okay and and black ops 3 because